Hello, today I'm going to show you how to set up the Microsoft Outlook add-in for the Chronify scheduler. So to do this, you need to first head to the Chronify for Office page on Microsoft App Source. You can find a link to this here in our documentation on the installation guide. Saw the link for Microsoft App Source page. So once you're here, if you first get it now, it'll take you through and it may ask you to sign in if you haven't already signed in. And then now if you're an admin, here is where you would edit the users and you can decide which members of your organization this app is rolled out to. If you're not an admin, you're just an individual user, then that's all you need to do there. So now if you head to Outlook, I'm using Outlook Web, but this does also work with Outlook Desktop. You press New Message. You should see the Chronify add-in is added here. You can also edit this if you press this button, press Get Add-ins. You search for Chronify here. So you could also add it here if you're an individual user, and this is where you'd also remove it as an individual user. So now that ends here, I'll just do a quick test for you. So I send the test email. And then as my cursor's here, if I press the button, it'll bring the side panel here where I can create a quick scheduling request. So for more information on how to create a scheduling request, just follow the video we have on that on our documentation site. But if I hit create invitation link, you'll see the links button here where my cursor was in the email. There's also a link to the scheduling request here as well, and you're good to go. Thank you.